Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well and having a festive week. In today's video, we're gonna be doing some Christmas treats and snacks for birds. So we are going to be doing a Christmas chop with some of the typical ingredients you'd find in a British Christmas dinner. We're also doing an edible Christmas tree made of herbs and we're also doing fruity Santas as well. So something for everyone. It's all a bit of fun um, just for this time of year and hopefully you can try these treats with your birds and see what they think. Even if you don't celebrate Christmas, they're still fun treats that you can share with your birds so let's get straight into it so first up we have got our Christmas dinner chop now every family does Christmas slightly different but I thought I'd show you some of the selection of some typical things we have in our Christmas dinner and then we're gonna put it all together for the birds chop for the week so I've already prepared all the vegetables because you guys have seen me prepare vegetables loads and if you haven't you can watch my how to make chop video if you want to see the full process but on the table here we're going to start up here we have got some broccoli I've kind of half riced it and half kind of chunked it so there's a bit of uh, texture in there we've got some grated carrot always a favorite high in vitamin a always a bonus we've also got some parsnip it does look like cheese but it's definitely parsnip um I hated parsnip as a child and now I absolutely love it. I could eat roasted parsnips all day and all night. So hopefully the birds will enjoy that too. We've also got some grated Brussels sprouts. Um, grating isn't the normal way to prepare Brussels sprouts, but I thought it would kind of, the textures would flow together nicely. And uh, again, I really like Brussels sprouts. Not everybody does. Let me know in the comments if you like Brussels sprouts or not. Then we've got the bird's ultimate favorite, which is peas. You can feed frozen peas either raw, thawed out, or you can cook them. It's totally fine either way. And then in the middle here, we've got some rosemary. Now, of course, most roast dinners will come with roast potatoes, but white potatoes aren't as nutritious uh, as other vegetables. So instead of having the potatoes, we are just gonna go with the rosemary there. And we are gonna combine this all together. I'm gonna pop it hopefully in this bowl. We'll see if it fits. <laughs> We're gonna do a jump cut and then we will see what it looks like all together. So let's get this ready now. And here we go, we have got our Christmas dinner chop. I mean, I think the presentation's okay, uh, but the birds don't mind. These are ingredients that they all like, um, but yeah, it's a really fun little mix, and there's lots of healthy goodness and vitamins, minerals, and just general all round healthy goodness in this lovely raw chop. So we're gonna see what the birds think. I'm sure they're gonna enjoy it, but of course, whenever we're filming, they like to mess around, so we'll see what kind of clips we get. But yeah, it's always awesome to try and include some of the vegetables you're using in your weekly meals into your bird's chop to kind of avoid waste but also to make things interesting so you can mix it up each week. We are making a birdie safe edible Christmas tree made out of a variety of herbs. Now, David and I talk about herbs all the time on our channels, and that's because they make fun toys, they are excellent to add into your bird's diet, and there's so much variety as well. Always check safe lists before you feed anything to your birds. But what I have here for my birdie safe Christmas tree is some rosemary, which is a massive favorite with our birds. We've got some dill, we've got some thyme, and then we've got some mint as well. So a nice variety there, different tastes and textures. And uh, what we're gonna do, very simply, we're gonna take some paper string. Uh, this is obviously bird safe because it is paper. We don't wanna be using any kind of plastic string or cotton or anything that could cause crop impaction. And we are just gonna bundle all these herbs together at the top, and then you can either hang it in your bird's cage or you can just play with it out and about. And I'm gonna do that now off camera because I'm gonna make a great big mess. And then here we have it. We have our little bird safe edible Christmas tree. It's just a little bit of fun, but it's also really healthy for your birds. So this is gonna be awesome. We're gonna go and give it to the birds now and see what they think, but I'm pretty sure they're gonna be licking and destroying and chewing it, which is what you want from any kind of interaction with toys with your birds. treat we're making today is a bit of fun it's a fruity Santa and now that obviously this is a lot of fruit so this is kind of a one-off special treat for the big day so what we've got is we've got some bananas we've got some strawberries and some hemp seeds as well so it's very simple to put together all I've done is I've taken some strawberries I've sliced off the strawberry tops so I've got a nice flat surface to work with 
And then I've sliced just a little bit further through the strawberry there, so it's in half. And then I'm going to put one slice down on the flat plate there. I'm then going to get a nice big chunk of banana that I've sliced up and I'm going to pop that onto my slice of strawberry. And then I'm going to put my strawberry hat back on. So it kind of looks like a little Santa. You've got his kind of little face there. You've got the two sides of the strawberry. But just to finish it off as well, I think he should probably have some eyes. So we're going to use some hemp seeds here. I'm going to pop them into the banana so he can be looking at us and saying, hello, I'm ready to be eaten by some very hungry parrots. Might be a bit fiddly because we're touching sticky kind of wet fruit. So I'm just going to press the hemp seeds into his little face. And it's a bit fiddly, but it's all just a bit fun. We're not about presentation here. We're about having fun at Christmas with our parrots. There is our little festive Santa. He's not the best to look at, but he's trying his best. And we are going to give this to the Conyers now so they can go and have a lot of fun. So I hope you enjoyed seeing these festive Christmas treats for your birds. Let me know if you make any of them. If you share them on Instagram, tag me on Instagram. It's at birdnerdsophie. I'd love to see your festive creations. If you've got any of your own, please do share them down in the comments. I would love to speak to you. But in the meantime, from me and the flock, it's Merry Christmas. I hope you're having an amazing festive time. Happy holidays. And thanks for tuning in again to my channel. And take care and see you later.